people of YouTube. You're still alive? You're still here? I mean, I thought I left you guys a long time ago. So, I don't need you in my life anymore. Nah, but in all seriousness, people of YouTube, hello. Yes, I'm alive. I'm back. An almost full swing of things. Um, <laughs> with yet another update video. Um, I know I've been doing quite a lot of these as of late. And I know I probably really shouldn't. Uh, cause, well, my real job is to kind of, you know, provide you with a little anime review content at least once per week. And for the most part, I have. You know, I, I've been consistent during the summer, and I've been kind of been pushing forward to get animes done by, you know, the week later. But just, though, these past two weeks, I'll be honest, I've been pretty freaking lazy at this moment. Like, uh... I've I've just been going through going through the motions with my summer vacation. Okay, and by the way, if you hear an ambient noise, that is my air conditioner. I have to have this thing on, or else it'll just my room would just become immediately hot. Like I'm not kidding you. Like it's so damn hot here where I live, and I can't stress that enough that I have to have this AC on. So if you hear this ambient noise, please forgive me. So yes, recently I've been freaking lazy with anime. Uh, reviews of the, as of late, but that will soon literally almost change because I do have an anime in progress that I'm almost done finishing. I just have to persevere and finish the rest of it. And plus, I did start a pretty lengthy anime, and I hope to finish by October because you'll understand the review once October comes. Like I'm hopefully by October I could finish this anime. To get it done for you because it's so fitting for the month of October because it's a long anime first off. It's, it's okay, I'll give you a hint. It's over 74 episodes and it's under the category of horror and th thriller. That's all I'm going to say. But, um, I can't wait to actually review this anime. Like, already because I'm getting way too ahead of myself. But, but... For the most part, I've been kind of going through the swing of things. I'm almost done with a certain anime. I hope to finish it this week. In fact, I'm hopefully f planning to finish it after I probably finish this review. And plus another video which we're about to talk about. And, um, all in due time, people of YouTube. All in due time. Let's just say I am back. I'm going back to the swing of things. And I hope to have this anime review done. Um, hopefully by Wednesday, okay? Um, reason why I kind of say Wednesday because tomorrow I'm planning another, well actually after this video, I'm planning on recording another video and hopefully putting it out by tomorrow. Sorry for the jump cut my mother called. Um, nah, just, I hope to get back into the swing of things hopefully by Wednesday, but after this video, you're hopefully going to get another video that I hope to, uh, finish because it's going to be a top 10 list. Holy crap, another the top 10 list. I haven't done a top 10 list in like God knows how long. And um, it's going to be an interesting one. I hope you guys will be here to hear my take on this. Um, it's going to be a really interesting top 10 list. I think it's probably one of the most fun top 10 lists I'm ever going to have. And possibly an anime review. The coming soon I just hope to finish it because you know and I'll give you a little hint on what the anime review is because if you're kind of under my circumstance you probably understand why but it's a uh, it's actually a harem it's a harem anime and I live with basically a, a lot of women <laughs> so it's like it's kind of hard to watch a harem so I have to watch it like on my phone which I use to record videos with but it's it's an interesting uh, anime, which I hope to uh, hope for you guys to hear my take on. I'm really enjoying it, by the way. I want to go back to it. I just need to, you know, be private. Anyway, possibly another reason why I've kind of been lazy is because of this thing. You know, it, it, it's, it's because of this thing. My, my 3DS. I had this 3DS since May, okay? And I got games on this thing that I've been really enjoying, okay? Like, oh, it's Fire Emblem. Look, I'm playing Fire Emblem, it's uh, Fire Emblem Fates, it's Birthright. 
And uh, if you can hear it, that's my theme. That's my that's the theme I'm playing. It's uh I bought the Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess theme. I also got Phoenix Wright and Pokemon Y. And my cousin actually has been letting me borrow some of his games. That uh some of his games. Like I played um Kirby, Triple Deluxe, a Kirby game. I haven't played a Kirby game in like a long time, and then uh he's letting me borrow Mario and Luigi Dream Team, which is actually in here. It's actually in here. Oh, uh, look. It's just, just to show you guys. See? I got Fire Emblem. And this is, and, uh, this is where I keep all my physical copies of games. Uh, let me borrow Dream Team. And then my friend, Alexis, he's letting me borrow Majora's Mask. Oh, here's Pokemon Heart Gold. And Smash is in here, my Smash Bros. copy. But it's my 3DS and plus I got some uh, stuff to do on my PS4. Like I, I, I bought Bloodborne and I've been addicted to Bloodborne. Like it's a difficult game, but it's so much fun to play. And but I have friends who also play Bloodborne, so they've been helping me play the game. They help me get better at the game. And you know it's just a mixture of things. You know a lot of gaming. I mean it's my summer. I deserve to play some games and watch anime. But also in between, I have to do uh, a lot of a lot of um, stuff around my home, and uh, that's whatever. It's no big deal. I do have stuff to do. I'm only human. I have responsibilities I have to do and stuff, and it's been cutting into my YouTube time. Okay, and plus you know I've also been watching a lot of YouTubers uh, lately. Like like all my YouTubers, fucking. All of them. And I've just been busy. I've just been preoccupied. And I, I do hope to get back into the swing of things this week. And starting off with the top 10 list that you're going to get hopefully uh, later on. Hopefully after after this video. Hopefully, fingers crossed. If I, if I have the chance to, I will. And, but no later than tomorrow. I will put out the top 10 list tomorrow. So if you're either going to get it today or tomorrow... Either way, it's going to be fun. More more than likely, it'll be possibly tomorrow because I have to get back into doing some other stuff. But other than that, that's going to kind of wrap this video up. Hopefully, top 10 list coming soon and then a new anime review. And uh, I can't wait to put out watch this special anime that I'm going to hopefully save until October. So when October comes, you guys are going to have a little treat. Okay, and plus October is one of my favorite months. It's my horror month, and then you also know that September, people of YouTube, September is my anime movie month, where I basically watch a bunch of anime movies, and I have a lot of anime movies in mind. Like I plan to finally watch Tokyo Godfathers. I plan to finally, actually, I plan to review a Studio Ghibli movie. I haven't, like, I haven't seen a good Studio Ghibli movie in a while. I think I'm possibly thinking of an anime uh, from Studio Ghibli that I probably already saw, like. Spirited Away. Um, I haven't seen My Neighbor Totoro in so long. Like, so long I haven't seen My Neighbor Totoro. I'm possibly thinking... Or possibly, like, one of the newer ones. Like, believe it or not, I never finished Ponyo. I know, I never finished Ponyo. And I loved... And I, from what I saw, I loved it. Or The Secret World of Arietti. Um, Who knows? I do hope to s review a Studio Ghibli film. Possibly one that I haven't already seen. Possibly one that I probably already saw, like when I was a kid. I do hope, but I know all the Studio Ghibli movies I re really do want to rewatch is My Neighbor Totoro and Spirited Away. Spirited Away is probably one of my favorite movies of all time. Like I'm not kidding you, it's a fantastic film. And believe it or not, I never saw Princess Monokone. Shocking, I know. I never saw Princess Monokone. I heard so many things. Yet yeah, I've never watched it. It's sad. I know. But I do want to watch My Neighbor Totoro. I love everything, either My Neighbor Totoro or Spirited Away. Who knows? Anyway, I'm done rambling on at this point. I can't wait for September. It's my anime movie month. Can't wait, because the thing about anime movies is that they're so quick, they're only like an hour, so like I can just watch it and review it at the same day. It's so much... Oh, I can't wait for next month, September. Oh, boy. That's going to be the week after. So, that Thursday, September 1st, so September, like it's on my calendar, as you can see. So like September first isn't until next Thursday. So the following week is gonna, or yeah, well technically next week 
is the first month of September. I'm excited, people. <laughs> okay, you have no idea. I'm pretty excited for September. You can tell, and October is probably one of my favorite months of all time, too. It's like, September and October, love them to death, okay? And December, you know, a bunch of other stuff. 12 days of anime, shit like that. And um, hopefully, actually, I plan on November to be, um, for the month of November, I plan to be like a revisit month. Like, me watching an anime that I possibly reviewed, yet wanted to give it like a full-fledged re-review, or an anime that I just never reviewed for YouTube in general. Like, I'm shocked I've never reviewed Rosario Vampire. Like, I'm shocked I haven't reviewed it because it's one of my favorite harem animes of all time. In fact, it was Rosario Vampire, Heaven's Lost Property, and, um, uh, shit. My, my Bride's a Mermaid. I can't believe I forgot My Bride's a Mermaid. That got me into anime to begin with. Like, that's how much I loved, um, those animes. I, I'm shocked I haven't reviewed that. I'm shocked. And I never reviewed, uh, Orion High School Host Club. And I'm, I'm I'm just shocked that I haven't reviewed some animes that I always wanted to rewatch. So hopefully November will be one of those ones, or possibly just me rewatching an anime I previously reviewed. Like I want to re-review Elf and Light. I haven't seen Elf and Light. In fact, I might rewatch that for the month of October. And I haven't reviewed Elf and Light, and I feel like when I, I what I said in that review didn't really hell up. And I feel ashamed for that review, kind of, although I refuse to kind of uh, re- uh, or delete it, because those are my old videos and thing and stuff like that, you know, it, it's it's weird. Um, but I do want to re-review -re -re animes that I possibly already saw, because, you know, lately, because, like, when I was young, okay, when, back in 2014, like, my tastes of animes were like still kind of fresh, you know, I was still a novice almost in it, when it comes to anime. And I didn't watch a lot of animes at that point, but now as I'm older, you know, I saw like a shit ton of animes. And now I know what really are my tastes and what are not my tastes. And among other things, though, that's what roughly the rest of the year. And, you know, as you know, December is my, you know, end of the year stuff, so I... And you know what? One of the what's pretty cool, I haven't reviewed a pretty like a shitty anime like at all this year. Like I've been like nothing but just watching pure and utter goodness. Like you know, I think like with the minor exception of like Kizu Niver, which was kind of boring, and then there was um you know Say I Love You, which was also kind of boring. But for like the most part, I've uh. I've been really um, watching, like, being consistent with just good anime. It's just, like, nothing but good anime. And I I love it. I love just me watching good anime. It's not, not me just watching the filth and just having to rage through it. Because last year, I saw shit. I saw shit. Like, there was Ikken. Then there was Screen Green. Then there was Demon and King Dynamo. Then there was uh, a whole bunch of shit last year when in the month of August and I didn't want to do that again like ever so yeah that's basically the rough schedule basically the entire year so it's only an update but also an update of like the whole like what's gonna happen next year so like just a quick recap okay September my favorite uh, September and October two of my favorite months okay also yeah um nah for forget what I was just gonna say um, September and October, my two favorite months, my anime movie month, and my horror month, which I can't wait. I can't wait to just watch pure horror. I love horror, okay? Like, one of my friends recommended me a solid horror anime to review, and I can't wait. Uh, November is going to be my revisit month, where I just rewatch old animes, possibly old animes that I've reviewed in the past, but yeah, uh, you know, need revisited and also just re- vision of stuff and then November uh, December you know year end shit 12 days of anime duh I'm gonna do it even if no one does it and uh that's it so lengthy update video basically outlining what's gonna happen for the next year small recap new anime top 10 list tomorrow or possibly today who knows I'll just get it done and more than likely tomorrow, and 
new anime review either Tuesday, Wednesday, possi possibly also even tomorrow if I get it through it. And yeah, that's basically gonna wrap this top 10, uh, top 10, that's basically gonna wrap this video up. I've been rambling on for way too long. I need to go back and play some fucking Fire Emblem Fates and, um, <laughs> yeah, or possibly more Bloodborne. I haven't played Bloodborne in I should go back to Bloodborne. And I also plan to get Overwatch lately. I want Overwatch. Who knows? We'll see. So until then, people of YouTube, this is the Crimson Assassin signing out. I've been talking for way too long. Peace.